Hello everyone. Uh, welcome back to Voxel Tycoon. Uh, I'm calling this one Charles Town, uh, mostly because the uh, main town in the starting uh, region is Charles Town. Now, last time around, got a basic, um, basic uh, uh, game operational, uh, basic network. Uh, so we're uh, coming out positive on the uh, the uh, cash flow, uh, which is uh, you know, important uh, for uh, getting started. Uh, so we have our headquarters, uh, and uh, you know that's a new development in the recent uh, patch or update. You know that's fine. Uh, it it does uh, you know nice enough. What I'm going to do now is establish a research campus. Now you don't have to do it this way and this is something I'm just trying out uh, for the first time uh, now uh, and that's uh, I'm doing it uh, I'm going to try it this way because I, I want to uh, run a game where I don't focus full-time hard on the maximizing the research and instead uh, work on development of the map and then have the research running in the background at a relatively low pace so that it doesn't erode all my money. Uh, so, uh, but the ultimate goal is still to get to computing devices, which once you research that, you get the win screen. Uh, now it doesn't end the game at that point, but it's a win condition. Like basically, it's the end of the research tree and uh, it's really complicated to get there. So I'm going to try and play this one out until I get there. But uh, in the meantime, uh, to meet uh, the demands, we're going to need to uh, collect enough money to pick up a region with stone, a region with copper, and a region with sand. Uh, and then uh, we'll also need that to complete the research tree. Uh, so the first thing I'm going to do is establish, uh, well, let's see, how big is a terminal? Uh, rotate. Uh, so it's uh, one, yeah, okay, so if I put the terminal there okay I'll put a ter put the terminal there uh, I'm going to need a uh, lab which I can't afford at the moment uh, no that's uh, 100k uh, I'm going to need uh, I'm going to need a couple of warehouses which I'm going to I'm going to dump them right here along the, the road. Uh, now, the first research I'm going to do, uh, what's it going to need? Coal? Uh, yeah, I'm not sure. I can't remember. Uh, but I'll need a warehouse for, for sure. Uh, now let's uh, up the tempo here, uh, just so that uh, some cash can come in. Uh, I'll build the um, the research lab here, uh, which I'll just uh, smash in, say, right here when we have enough money. Uh, now. Uh, you can do all of the research with just the one lab, and that's what I'm going to try doing this time around. Uh, but, you know, that's um, uh, it's not necessary. And I find it convenient for some of the early research to just plop the lab right beside the resource it needs. But I'm not going to do that this time. Um, right. Well, we're up to 70k, so yeah, we've got a healthy income operating. 
Uh, you definitely want to do the research, uh, at least the early stages of research on uh, on this stuff anyway, uh, so that you can get uh, get up to diesel trucks at the very least, diesel engines. Uh, and you really want to get up to the point where you can do uh, electric trains. Uh, electric trains tend to be gruntier than the uh, diesels. Um, but still, uh, you want to get up to the diesel trucks at the very least, uh, just because they carry more. Uh, you can get up to semi trucks and they do pretty good for transport. Uh, so, yeah, you definitely want to get there. Okay, so we got the research lab. Now, uh, if we start uh, research, uh, manufacturing only requires money. And that allows us to build conveyors and connectors. Right. Um, uh, oh, we need wood beams for mining too. Rails need stone. Roads need stone. Gasoline engine needs iron. Ah, yeah, gasoline engine, right. And steam engine requires coal. Right, so we're going to want to bring in iron and iron ore and coal initially. Right. Well, that we can definitely do. So... Uh, but first of all, let's start researching manufacturing. Now, this is going to use up our... Uh, well, I'm going to set this for iron. Uh, now, this is going to use up our cash uh, uh, until it finishes researching. Now, uh, we definitely need this so that we can build our factory areas. So, uh, yeah, it, it used to start out with this research um, way back, but... Uh, I think it's kind of good that you need to research it to uh, get started. Uh, right. Uh, so I'm, I've left it on uh, max max speed here uh, for this point, uh, just so that we can get past it quicker. You know, it, it's really it's uh, uh, it's just a little bit tedious when you get to a point where you kind of need to wait something out. Okay, so we're just about there. And then I'll switch it to gasoline too. There we go. Uh, new research. Um, okay, we can do iron smelting, which is going to need iron, or gasoline engine too. Well, we'll start with gasoline engine too. Now, what we need to do is bring iron ore in. Now where's the iron mine? It's uh, over here, right. Okay, so we'll buy a truck uh, that can carry ore. Yep, that's iron ore. Uh, we obviously can't buy it until we can afford it. Nope. Yep. Um, well, we can borrow enough to afford it. Okay. Right, now, uh, here we're going to uh, we're going to full load here and we're going to uh, full unload here and we're going to call that um, Um, right. Well, we're just going to call that. Okay. Uh, come on. Click the right stuff. Good. Now, release. Good. Okay. So that'll get the, uh, the research ticking along at some sort of a speed, but, uh, it shouldn't be so fast that it erodes everything, which is kind of what I want. Now, uh, 
Now, what we need to do is build up enough resources that we can buy a region. So how much is, say, this one going to cost? 1.1 mil. Yeah, that's going to take a moment. Now, uh, we don't have any demands that aren't being met. But we do need to, uh, what did we need for that one research? Uh, what did we need for it? Um, wood processing. Uh, we need wood. Ah, okay. Well, in that case, uh, well, let's, uh, let's keep the tempo up. Um, right. Yeah, so this will uh, make the uh, research quite slow, but uh, it should, uh, it should at least, uh, you know, keep it running. Uh, without, uh, as I said, uh, eroding our entire bank balance, which is kind of where I'm going with this. Um, okay, it's going to do a uh, research step, and it's going to have to do that 34 more times. Uh, and then, uh, right, while I'm... Uh, uh, warehouses, yep. Okay, so we'll uh, put uh, another one of those here and we'll set it for logs. And I'm going to start bringing logs in as well. Uh, what I want to check is if terminals I can get the yeah I can get a second terminal good what okay they really need to fix that uh, okay uh, now I want to duplicate the wrecked vehicle Uh, and then remove it. Okay, come on. Okay, now remove. Uh, release. Okay. Yeah, they really need to fix that. Uh, now, where's the... Uh, right. I uh, need to... Where's the logs? There it is. Uh, right. Okay. So, I'm uh, going to need one of those. Need 30k for that. Yeah. Uh, that's going to take a moment. Uh, here, yeah. So, yeah, that's going to be an effective way to do the uh, the research uh, collection here. Uh, right. Okay, that's uh, just done. Yeah, so we're uh, uh, a seventh of the way through already. Uh, on that research. So, yeah, it's uh, definitely going to work. Now, uh, you know, this is the problem with the early game on uh, all of the ones like this, where you end up waiting for um, uh, for stuff to happen, right? Uh, okay, now we can buy that. Good. Okay. Uh, where is it? There it is. Uh, okay, so that one, 
full load here and then full unload here yep and we'll make a line out of it and launch it good so that'll start uh, bringing in logs to fill up that warehouse uh, and that will uh, well, maybe we can uh, start uh, more research right away. Uh, but we definitely need to build up so we can buy uh, this Oskaloosa region. Uh, yeah. Um, then at uh, some point, I will need to start building uh, uh, the uh, more industrial um, uh, things at the factories. Uh, where we uh, smelt uh, iron, um, uh, you, you know, um, you know, cut up wood, uh, you know, into sawmill, you know, whatever. Uh, I'll need to start uh, deploying that. But we don't have any of the uh, more advanced demands yet. They will turn up, but we don't have any yet. Um, right. Okay, well, it's, it appears to be ticking along. Um, right. Okay, so we're uh, collecting uh, logs. Uh, the uh, research into gasoline engine 2 is uh, ticking along. Yeah, okay, uh, that's, uh, that's working. Now, something that uh, that I like to do, just because it's um, it makes expanding your uh, cities um, easier, is uh, I like to flatten the uh, the ground. Uh, but it costs a lot of money, uh, so I generally don't do that unless I have a reason to. I uh, like you know to. Uh, uh, make it so that the roads will connect up or something like that on the road grid. Now, uh, sometimes I'll uh, erase the water. Uh, now, I think there's something coming in a near-term update that's going to change the way water works, and that may change the way I uh, deal with it in the game. But uh, regardless, uh, the way it works now, you can just, you know... Um, terraform the, the water out by lowering the water level uh, and then you can fill it in re raise the uh, terrain and poof the water's gone so yeah anyway um, yeah okay so I don't think there's anything uh, significant that we can really do at this point. I mean, uh, we could supply the uh, uh, businesses with more. Uh, that'll drive prices down, though. So, yeah, really, uh, we're just uh, waiting out uh, some research and some demands to pop up. But that requires the towns growing. Right. Well, that seems to be doing okay. Yeah, it does seem to be doing okay. So, um, who belongs to these? Oklahoma City. Why is it building that far out? Yeah, that's kind of odd. Yeah, whatever. Uh, right. Well, anyway. Let's see. Yeah, that's, uh, that's ticking through. You know, we're a third of the way through it. Uh, so, what I'm, I think I'm going to do... Uh, I'm not sure actually. Uh, 
Maybe I should throw some more uh, throw some more vehicles at a couple of these. Uh, how's this uh, doing? Uh, we're delivering 60 of 130. Yeah, that's um, definitely a... Uh, Well, that's definitely a, a reason we might, uh, no, don't click there, uh, duplicate that. And, of course, miss it. Um, well, it'll be easier if I slow the thing down. Uh, that one, yep. And if I duplicate it two more, two of them, I can launch a couple more trucks there. Um, yeah. And this one, yeah, that one could stand a duplication as well. Okay. Um, uh, yeah. Okay, well, we'll, um, uh, what, you can't duplicate those from, uh, from the list there, huh? Okay, well, that one is... Yeah, that one. Well, if we double the throughput on this one, yep, that uh, should uh, increase the uh, cash flow quite a bit. How's that one doing? Same deal there. Okay. Okay, that. Oh, not enough money. Right, yeah, that's uh that's definitely gonna slow down the plan. Right. Really? Okay. Okay, that one. Right. Uh, dupe. Oh, not enough. Right. So you might be wondering why, uh, why I, I don't start with trains. Uh, well, the reason I don't start with trains is because they're a lot more expensive to build. And uh, they're a lot less flexible. And as a result, it makes the early game uh, really difficult to not go bust. Uh, so by using trucks, you're pretty much guaranteed that you won't uh, go bankrupt as long as you connect stuff up sanely. And, you know, so don't build uh, whacking great roads across uh, whacking great distances. You know, uh, it, it's just you know do, don't don't do stuff that's really expensive or put 90 trucks on a line. You don't need to. And definitely don't try to just saturate everything, right? Uh, because that um, will drive the price down. And uh, that's definitely not what you want to do. Uh, anyway, 
Uh, this is coming up on the 25 minute mark here. Um, I think uh, I've probably done about all I'm going to do uh, this time around. Uh, I'm going to try and avoid uh, doing any kind of jump cuts or time lapse or whatever. Uh, you know, I'll uh, tinker around. You know, the next part will probably be a little bit more of the same. You know, tinkering around. Um, you know, keep getting things, uh, you know, built up. But we got a got our research going here. Uh, yeah, we're halfway through now. Um, I could build a second uh, lab there, but uh, you know, the benefits minimal. Uh, you could do some of the research faster, but uh, you know, because you could do more than one at a time, but. Uh, I'm not uh, convinced that there's a particularly huge benefit for doing that. Uh, not not really. Uh, so uh, what I'm going to do, actually, is uh, repay uh, bits of the loan. Now, uh, there are those that would insist that if you don't have the maximum loan all the time, uh, you're, uh, you're costing yourself opportunity. Uh, because it's money that you could have spent expanding your network. True, but if you don't have anything particular to expand at a given time, uh, oh, there we go. We've got a new point of sale. If you don't have anything to expand at any given time, uh, then there's no particular benefit to um, doing so, right? Uh, oh, I can use, I can use the existing station. Uh, and then you're just paying the uh, borrowing costs for no real benefit. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to deliver uh, coal to Oklahoma North there. Okay. So now I'm going to have to take the loan out again, right? Uh, I need something that'll take coal. Yeah. Uh, and this is going to go full load here and a full unload over here. And we'll line it. Okay. And, and we'll, we'll chuck four on here. Uh, we'll release the ninjas uh, and repay the one bit of loan that we can we can afford to at the moment. Now we'll up the tempo again. Uh, so that's uh, another um, demand, right? So that's more um, more cash that we can have coming in. And that's really what it's about in the early game is when a, uh, a business that you can supply pops up, you supply it. Now, I would expect another demand to pop up in Charlestown at some point, uh, though it hasn't yet, uh, which is kind of surprising. Um, but anyway, it will at some point. Uh, this here, um, yeah. Okay, well the town's busy growing, so that's that's at least good. Uh, okay. Um, right, so uh, so that's basically how I'll be uh, tinkering through here is uh, I'll be repaying the loan as it comes up, and. Uh, uh, basically, the idea is to get to the point where we can buy a region. Uh, now, obviously, we might end up taking out the whole loan just to do that, and that is fine. It's just a case of, uh, you know, if you don't have the 10k a month uh, uh, borrowing cost, it, you get there slightly faster. That's really what it comes down to. It's uh, pure math, right? Uh, anyway, uh, well, this is coming up on half an hour, and I think 
that's probably long enough for a part, really. So uh, I'm going to uh, leave it here uh, for now. Uh, and uh, you know, I guess the next part should be up uh, next week, uh, same same time. Uh, and uh, yeah, so stay healthy. Don't let the zombie apocalypse get you down. And I guess I'll see everybody back next time.